Hey dolls! So, as you guys know, I absolutely love Poshmark, and they partnered with me for another video, so thank you Poshmark for sponsoring this, but it has that time again where I clean out my closet, I go through my closet, I get rid of a lot of clothing, a lot of items, just random things that have just maybe sat there that I don't use, that maybe I've received in the past for videos, and I've just never gotten around to using them or wearing them and some of it I do sell but a lot of it I do donate so the stuff that you're seeing in today's video is not just the stuff that I'm getting rid of there is a lot more like a whole other box full that will be donated to local thrift stores but before I get on into showing you guys what I have for sale up on my Poshmark I want to let you guys know that you can download the Poshmark app 100% for free in the description box below Click the first link to download it. But I love Poshmark. I'm always constantly on there scrolling late at night looking for brands like Betsy Johnson, Forever 21, Hot Topic stuff, shoes like Why Are You, and everything like that. So I'm constantly on the app myself and I also love selling my stuff on there. So with that, now I'm going to jump on into the video and show you guys what I will be selling on my Poshmark. And there will also be a few other items as well as such as phone cases, a camera case or something like that possibly, um, and a few other items. I'm kind of updating it gradually. It's not just like all at once. So uh, yeah, keep an eye out on my Poshmark. My username on there is Amanda31409. And if you guys do have closets of your own or if you are selling some of your stuff, leave your usernames in the comment section down below so everyone in the comments can go and check out your little closet and shop your stuff as well. Okay, so I'm overwhelmed and don't really know what to start off with first, so I guess I'll just start off with the big item here. This is a Rila Kuma tote bag. It is huge, massive. It's kind of like a duffel bag in a way. This would be awesome to use it as a gym bag or um, to take on weekend trips or overnight stays. It is brand new, still has the tags on it. I just prefer Co Rila Kuma instead of Rila Kuma. And so this brown color doesn't really go with my aesthetic and doesn't really match a lot of my like pastel clothes. So I am selling this little guy. It's very, very roomy, has a zipper closure, and it is huge. Like, I could fit my dog and, like, three other small dogs in here, too. Um, yeah, it's really great, really good quality. It is 100% San X brand verified. It's not a knockoff or anything like that, so it is real, real Akuma. Um, so yeah, this little guy, or this big guy, is on my Poshmark. Okay, now moving on to the clothing. I'm just gonna grab a random item and just go through it here. So these are some, like, kind of denim-style shorts, but these are awesome because one side is this floral detail, and they are reversible, so if you whoosh, flip them inside out, that went a little less smooth than... I pictured it in my head. If you flip them inside out, there is this snake skin side. So they are reversible. You can zip and button them on both sides. So it does have two buttons, like double-sided buttons. And it's pretty they're pretty cool. I ever I only wore these a couple times. They're not really my style anymore, so that's why I am selling them. But they're in pretty good condition. You can see the tag is like really worn down, but these are a size three. So those are up. Then you guys might recognize these from a Forever 21 haul, probably my most recent one that I did. These are pastel light pink leggings and they're pretty stretchy. But these, I got these when I went to Forever 21 and I ended up buying two pair of these because I couldn't complain about leggings for $3.90. Uh, so I bought two pair of these, but literally but my tushy <laughs> won't really fit into these guys they're a little bit too snug on me as you can see they don't really have a lot of stretch in the booty area so unfortunately i have to put these up on my poshmark so there will be two pair of these up on my poshmark and you guys know that the closest forever 21 to my house is like two hours away so it's not like i can just go in store and exchange them super easily so 
yeah okay next up just picking randomly from the pile this is a beautiful little swim cover like kimono style it is gorgeous has this beautiful floral detailing on it i've had this forever i just never really have worn it and so I am selling it, but it is really long floor length. You guys can see like full try on photos on my Poshmark. So I'm not going to try any of these on, on camera for you guys, but you'll be able to see kind of like what they look like on. It does have two little strings that you can wrap around your body and then back around and tie for closure. If you just wanted to wear it as a dress, you probably could get away with that because it's kind of lined a little bit but this is on there I'm not going to talk too much about these items because you can pretty much see what they look like and everything in the photos um this is a small i believe but it'll probably fit medium or large considering it's just like an open thing it doesn't have like it's not very fitted i should say it's kind of just like a drape over another random item this is adorable i remember getting this but I never really wore it and I think that's because I'm the type of person to usually always just sleep in either like a tank top and shorts or a t-shirt and shorts. I never really sleep in like super long pants and long sleeves. This adorable Betsy Johnson pajama top. I do not have the bottoms. I only have the top but it is a beautiful floral print. I love this print so much. I love this fabric so much. I just wish that I was able to wear it more. I'm sure you could probably wear it as like a cardigan or something and nobody would really think anything of it, but it's also black and I do have a cat and she has white hair so she sheds all over everything so I can't wear black as much anymore as well so that's like half the reason I never wear it is because it gets full of cat hair immediately um so this kind of has another thing to do with it is I can't really wear it because my cat likes to cuddle me at night and in the mornings when I just wake up and if I'm wearing all black I will get covered head to toe in hair so or it will be visible at least if I'm wearing black other colors it doesn't show as easily obviously but yeah so Betsy Johnson this is a size small as well oh no, I lied it's a size medium this is a medium so it'll fit small and medium I suppose Moving on, another long sleeve item. This is a kind of fleece style light pink hoodie and it just looks like this. The little zipper on it is a little heart which is a very cute detail and the ears, there is a little hood and it has bunny ears on it so it is very cute. You guys might remember this from previous videos. I really only ever wore it like once or twice. I don't know why. I don't know why I never wore this. Um, it's pretty long so it'll like cover your butt even if you wanted to just wear it with leggings or something. It's very very cute and it's very warm and cozy. I just kind of never really wore it. It was just taking up space in my closet. So if you guys want to get your hands on that, you can. That is a small as well. Now, random item. I got this at Value Village um, a couple years ago. It might have been last year or the year before, but it is a light up tutu and this was in their Halloween little section that they had during Halloween time and the Halloween stuff wasn't like marked down. They didn't sell the Halloween stuff cheaper or anything. They just had like a section for the Halloween stuff and they sold it at like retail price, like normal price. And so I got this tutu and the tag is on it. The original tag, it says $16.99. That's what I paid for it. It says one size on the tag. It might fit up to a large. I'm not 100% sure. It has a little bit of stretch to it, but I am about a small or medium and it fits both just fine. So this is a light up tutu. There is a little pack in here. So to get it to light up, you just undo the Velcro, pull out the little switchy right here, and then you can switch it on if I can remember where the button is. And it has these little wires in here and they do a light up. It's not o over the whole entire tutu. It's just kind of like focused on one side. But this is really cute. It does blink. This is really cute for Halloween or looks or cosplay maybe even. Whatever you really want to do with it, you can probably do. Um, 
I think I tried it on like once or twice, but I never ended up using it. I love the colors though. They're very, very cute. And of course, you don't have to use this with the lights. You can probably just take the lights out of it completely and just use it as a regular tutu skirt. And then this romper right here is absolutely cute. Um, I never wore this because it still has the tag on it. That's not why I never wore it, but it still has the tag on it. I've never worn it. It just has sat in my closet. <laughs> um, but it is a neon pink romper with super cute yellow and blue flowers. And I think there are a couple little small belt loops right here. So you could string a belt through it if you wanted to. I don't believe it came with one. Maybe it did. I think maybe it did come with like a beaded belt or something like that. But I can't find it. So uh, you just get the romper, but it is cinched at the waist, and this is a small or medium? Small. This is a small, um, but it would probably fit a medium as well, because I usually am a medium um, in my bust, and I had no problems with it. It does have a zipper up the back and a super cute little keyhole in the front, and it's just very, very cute. I love the color of it and everything. I just... I don't know. I never really wore it. I never gravitated towards it. So I'd rather someone else have it that can get more use out of it than me, if you know what I mean. Okay, and then another dress is, you guys are going to remember this from like a long time ago. It is this Pinkie Pie G4 My Little Pony striped dress. This is an extra large in little girls, but it will fit a small or medium in juniors. Um, I loved this thing so much. I would wear this as like a summer dress for a long time, but you guys know me. I'm not as much into G4 My Little Pony as I am like G1 and G3 mainly. <laughs> that was a pony pun. Did you get it? Brum, boom. So I figured that I would sell this and let someone have a piece of true manda memorabilia, <laughs> I guess. Um, and just, I don't know. It's very cute. It's very flowy. It's a super comfortable summer dress. I would wear it all the time over my swimsuits, but it doesn't have any bad stains or rips or marks or anything on it that I can find. So figured I would sell her and again let someone have a piece of me. <laughs> yeah, because you can just buy a piece of me online. And then along with that, my little pony item, there is also this Twilight Sparkle little tutu skirt. This is also an extra large in little girls, but it has a super elastic waistband. So this can obviously fit multiple sizes, which is awesome. I should probably stop stretching it out. Uh, but yes, you can see it has Twilight Sparkle on there after she became an alley corn. So she does have her wings. So there is that little skirt that will be up there as well. And then the last item that I'm going to show you guys in this video is this skirt. Um, it is originally from Hot Topic. I know you guys have probably seen it before. It's such a beautiful like pastel watercolor pattern. Um, I got this and it is a, the tag says small medium. You can tell I've never worn this either. I got it and it's too big on my waistband and I don't like the length of it. Um, I I could put in the effort to take it in on the sides and on the bottom but honestly I'd rather just sell it to someone who can appreciate it and then possibly put that money towards buying something that I would wear more or that I would like the fit of better just as is and not have to manipulate it to fit me better. Um, so I usually am a small in skirts like this, the high-waisted ones that sit higher up. Um, and this is a small medium, so it is a little bit big on me, but it does have a little bit of stretch to it, so it might fit a large depending. Um, but the length is weird on me because I'm only five foot, so these skater skirts like this, um, I'm very picky about the length on them because I want them to be like mid-thigh, but some of them go all the way to my knee, and some of them go to like my mid calf and they're just they're not the right length for me it's just kind of like a preference thing so there's nothing wrong with this it's literally just been hanging in my closet because I haven't been able to wear it and I want to make more space and kind of just like offload some of my stuff so 
originally from Hot Topic. I think it was like $25. I'll probably put it up there for like $20 or something. Maybe the same price. I don't know. I might give you guys a deal. Who knows? I don't know. But it is a very cute pastel print and I know that a lot of you guys who watch my videos will probably love and appreciate this. Those are the items that I'm going to show you guys in this video. Keep in mind that I will also probably be adding more items to my Poshmark gradually and remember that you can download the Poshmark app 100% for free using the first link in the description box below. And again, thank you so much Poshmark for sponsoring this video. I was gonna sell my stuff anyway and Poshmark always comes through and comes along and is like, hey, let's help you do this and let's help you sell this stuff and let's work together. And I'm always about working with companies that I truly support and I truly trust and I truly stand behind and Poshmark is definitely one of those. I wanna show you guys something real quick. This is gonna be in my next monthly favorites but I, I, wanna, I wanna give you guys a little sneak peek because I bought this off Poshmark the other day and I can't contain my excitement about it. Hold on, I'll be right back. Okay, so I was on the Poshmark app the other day and I found this sweater and it's originally from H&M and I had to have it and I snagged it for like a really good price. I think I paid like $5 for this, but look you guys, ah! it's a Lady in the Tramp sweater. How cute is this? Oh, this is why I love Poshmark because I can find stuff that has been sold out for months, possibly years, and get it at a super affordable price and be able to have it. And it's just, oh, I cannot wait so I can wear this with some leggings. Oh, it's so cute. Okay, enough of me talking. I'm going to let you guys go. Download Poshmark using the link in the description box below. And with that being said, I hope you all enjoyed this. Let me know what your favorite item was that I showed in the comment section, and I will talk to you all in my next video. That was a really good outro considering none of my videos are ever rehearsed. I just spit out what comes to mind. That came out pretty smooth. I won't even have to cut that. So I will talk to you all in my next video. So until then, so long, stay strong, stay true, and be you. All right.